Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. You could have spent this time doing anything else, but you decided to give this video a watch, so thanks so much for stopping by. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to achieve this quick and easy messy bun for short hair. You ready to do hair today? You have your hair brush? We do your hair? Uh, yeah? So the first thing that I do is start with my hair that is a couple days old so this will work better if your hair is not freshly washed what i do is i put in some dry shampoo this is the one that i am currently liking but you can use any dry shampoo that is your favorite this will just help give it a little bit more texture and grit so i just kind of spray it and rub it in so i'm working with about two day old hair and after i do that i will just comb it out a little so that'll help give it some texture so that it holds better in the bun because my hair is pretty short sometimes if i don't have enough texture to it or it's um it's just the strands are just like too silky i'll put in some of this dry wax spray so i like this better than hairspray because it doesn't make my hair crunchy but it does give it a lot of texture and um it's like a wax that i'll like put on my ends so i don't try to use this every time that I do this, but if I don't have enough texture and my hair is just like too silky or too um, clean, then I will put this in. Take my brush and from my ear up, I'll brush it and grab it all the way to the other side. So, kind of looks like a half up half down just smooth it out so that it's one continuous ponytail and I don't have like hair hanging down here in the back take my brush again and work on combing the back of my hair up into my hand and since I have short hair some of it in the back will fall down, like as you can see, some of it falls down. And that's okay because we will bobby pin it. I position it pretty high up, like right on the top of my head. So once I do that, I have my elastic on this hand. I take the ponytail and I wrap it around. I have a loop holding my hair. I take this hair and wrap it around. So I get like a little ballerina top knot. And then I just secure it with an elastic. Then after I have it in this knot, First of all, I like to bring some pieces down to kind of frame my face because I like it to look messy, but still put together, if that makes sense, a little bit better. Okay, so then I take this and kind of pull it in from the front, from the back, and just shape it and fluff it up. Because I don't like it being so, I don't like it being so tight on my head. It will look a little crazy at first. That's where bobby pins come in. So I kind of just shape it to where I like it.
Take your bobby pins and bobby pin it down. So I just keep reshaping until I get it how I like it. I kind of make sure it's like even all the way around. So that looks pretty good to me. See some of this is falling down in the back because of my hair being short, it doesn't stay up in the ponytail. So I basically just grab this in the back and just kind of smooth it out. And then take a bobby pin and pin it. Now, I don't like how this is slicked down. So what I do is I kind of take my hands like in a claw shape and I'll kind of just very lightly pull so that it's not so stuck to my head and it gives me more volume or the look of more volume. So after I'm done, like I said, I don't like to use hairspray. So I will use the dry wax spray to kind of hold it in place. Little hairs don't like fall out throughout the day. And it won't make my hair like crusty and hard. I kind of just use it to smooth any little flyaways. That completes the tutorial. This is how I do my mom bun with a short lob or mom cut. So I hope this tutorial was helpful and that you enjoyed it. As always, if you haven't already, please be sure to subscribe if you would like to continue to follow us as we live our life with Lily. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye guys. Hello. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,